Hi everyone, it's Aaron from The Pro Shop, and while we're practicing our social and physical distancing, I thought I'd stop by to help our Edmonton Country Club members hold more putts when the golf season starts rolling. First thing I'd like to start off with is posture. Um, I like to try and have a little bit more of an athletic posture, nothing too slouched, nothing too upright. Athletic posture meaning we're going to have a slight bend in our knees, and we're just going to let our arms fall to the center of the grip. And when they fall to the center of the grip, that's when you should know that you have a fairly good athletic posture. From there, grip pressure. Our grip pressure should be evenly distributed throughout the middle of the grip. Nothing too firm, nothing too soft. Probably about a 6 out of 10 on the scale. From there, I'm going to make a couple practice strokes while looking at the hole. The reason why I like to look at the hole just gives me a better sense of how hard I need to hit the putt for pace. After I've completed my practice strokes, I'm going to step into the putt and I'm going to sole my putter anywhere from quarter of an inch to about half an inch behind the golf ball. And then from there, I'm going to look directly behind the golf ball. You can either look at the front at the dimples, front of the golf ball, but I like to look directly behind the golf ball and fix my eyes there so that my eyes don't wander. And when your eyes wander, you're going to have a tendency to look at where the putter head's going. From there, you, your ball could go anywhere. You can hit the putt basically off the map. So after I have my putter sole about half an inch to a quarter of an inch, like I said earlier, away from the ball, I'm going to have one quick peek at the hole. And then from there, I'm going to make my nice and smooth stroke. Notice how my head is down. I'm just going to follow it with my eyes. And notice also how my putter is nice and low to the ground. That's going to, that's going to ensure that my ball is going to come off on the line that I want to hit it. I like to call it hug the rug, one of the better tips I've gotten in the past. Hopefully that helps you hold more putts. And we look forward to seeing you out there this year in 2020.